Well, hey guys, hi, Brent Abel, webtennis.com, back here with another episode of What's the Right Shot? And uh, today's episode, we've got Roger Pierce serving. His partner is Marty Pearson. Uh, the great Larry Turville, returning serve, and uh, yours truly. Uh, fortunate in this tournament to be able to partner to be partnered up with Larry, and uh, you know I want you to kind of observe a couple things here in terms of how Larry and I sort of work Larry's return to serve, uh, and you know kind of in a team effort. And you know the first thing that Larry is always doing, he is always looking to move forward through his return to serve. He's always thinking this is an approach shot opportunity. You can see him stepping inside the baseline quickly getting turned and set on this chip backhand. And from here, you know, what can he do? My gosh, I mean, he obviously can go down low here. Uh, he could take this if he wanted to and play a little chip lob. He's got a lot of options from that position, which really kind of frees uh, the, the server's net partner. But you know what? Larry decides to chip it on down low. And, and again, I want you to watch Larry on this. He's still moving forward. I mean, he's really looking at this as an approach shot opportunity. And yours truly, I am trying to take a look. I'm not worried about the poach here because I think Larry can go ahead and handle this serve uh, as he does. And now I'm trying to enhance that return with a little fake poach in there and at least try to visually distract the server Try to distract Roger in terms of uh, just kind of messing up, kind of dirtying up the landscape out there. And I think Roger gets a little bit, uh, I'm not going to say confused, but he just really decides uh, he's got me here. I've probably got the line covered. Uh, you know, we're both up at net. Now, Larry's inside the service line. And so the choices right here are uh, are not great for Roger. So he ends up going for a little lob over me. It ends up short, and uh, this is what I was talking about uh, in the uh, in the in the introduction to the blog post. Is I've got an easy shot, and uh, just like Jody Rush's father told him, if you never miss the easy shot, you know what? Chances are good you can become a national champion, and so. Uh, I want to hear what's on your mind. I mean, there's a lot to pick out from here, even though this is really such a simple point. I mean, um, it's it's just a standard return to serve point, but there's a lot to look at uh, in terms of Larry's mindset. This is an approach shot opportunity. I'm trying to dirty up the landscape. Uh, we're both getting inside the service line. I mean, both as a returning team, we've now got better court uh, better court positioning, and then finally, take your time. I mean, take your time on this. Look, you know that you know that you don't have to rush this because if you aim it to where you know the open court is, which is right down in here, and even if one of these two opponents guess, well, worst case is they're having to deal with a ball down low, and uh, if it comes back, the chances are still good. So take your time, don't reach too far in front, and just play it where you know you should. And uh, there you have it. So right down below uh, this video, in the comments area, I gotta hear from you. What's on your mind from this video? Let me know, and as always, you gotta get out there today and make it another spectacular day. So guys, I've got three more free but private return to serve training videos I want to get to you. You can get immediate access to these videos so that you can learn how to do the Turville chip and charge return to serve. And uh, you can also do the flat return as you see me doing right there. Right down below this video, there's a link. Click it and you'll get immediate free access to those videos.